Hello Virgo and welcome to your October 2018 time readings with me. If you're new to my channel dear Virgo, please do subscribe so that you're notified every time I release a new video. So let's see dear Virgo, what is the theme for us for the month of October and that's the bear and the key and what does it say? Well, 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 wonderful dear Virgo because it seems that uh, your financial position is getting better. Whatever the problems regarding finances, this the theme of this month is you are finding solutions, keys to how to improve your finances. I also see a wonderful motherly protection around you throughout this month of October. And also um, you might be protective about people around you, most probably your family. Yes, you are praying the big brother or the big sister or mama or grandmama. Yes. Um, you are playing the role of um, a protector uh, this is what is seen in this month and i am also seeing that you are trying to find solutions to your financial situation and um, rest assured is that the finances are going to become brighter and brighter uh, dear virgos so that's really good and secondly uh, also i see that the focus is going to be quite a lot about your health it's going to be about your weight it's going to be about the way of living that means um, how what you eat the, you are going to take a lot of care regarding what you're eating what you're putting in your tummy and yes uh, stomach and muscles are the areas that are going to be a little bit weaker so most probably this is going to push you into the healthy way of eating and living so a um, lot of exercises yoga uh, and uh, uh, stretching exercises are recommended for you by the cards i would say uh, for this month of uh, october and also i'm seeing that um, you are going to find solutions to key issues that have been bugging you for long my dear virgo now let us get on to our week by week reading so the first week once again they are confirming about the about the theme here and that shows finances that shows material well-being that shows abundance in material well-being and money and uh, somehow i'm feeling that there is something related to money i mean i'm getting the energies and uh, just seeing finances money 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 everywhere for you this month of october so uh, it's a wonderful thing because um, it seems that certain things that you have been pondering about and working hard towards are coming to fruition in the first week because you are, you are growing financially and also I'm seeing some kind of a lump sum amount coming to some of the Virgos. Uh, it can be really sudden windfall uh, for some of you that is coming in the first week. It also means that some of you have been selling uh, something like kind of a property like a house or a car and you are getting good returns on them and uh, for the people who have um, Virgos who have been selling uh, or waiting to sell um, something like, like a real estate yeah something related to real estate something related to the fixed assets this is what I see are getting very good returns upon it in the first week some of you you will be touching the heritage this is what is seen you are going to inherit something um, uh, in the form of money also i would like to tell you dear virgo is that when you are getting this lump sum money please take care not to squander it away not to waste it not to really go and you know uh, spend it into something big because i am seeing the energy also is that you're getting a lot and you want to spend a lot you know so please be careful you are the last people whom i should be telling this but I feel like telling so I am telling you um, dear Virgo and uh, so this is what is the energy for you and I also see somewhere on the personal front I see that uh, some Virgos are being a bit discreet about something they are hiding something inside of them there is something uh, that is not out in the open so whatever you are hiding inside of you dear Virgo at this point of time it can be a relationship with someone it can be some kind of a thing that you are trying to deal with uh, 
single-handedly don't do that my dear Virgo because it will affect your body and your mind too so you need to express it uh, I would really really um, suggest you to express it because um, if you keep it inside of you it will affect your body and the mechanism of your body so you don't want it like that and the stress what happens you will swell up with the stress so you don't need to do that uh, dear Virgo in the first week so you need to take care and once again it is rhyming with our um, theme of uh, theme cards also wherein uh, problems regarding weight gains uh, sudden weight gains or uh, you know regarding your alimentation and diet is coming into picture so please um, be kind with yourself and please be expressive my dear Virgo and with this energy of abundance and of taking care of your health we are going to the second week now the second week sees you dealing with papers okay the second week is a kind of a mixed week not very good nor very bad also but yes there will be certain things which can be a little bit stressing regarding paperwork I see a lot of paperwork for Virgos wherein uh, if you are into a lawsuit or something like that you are meeting uh, your lawyers and there's a lot of things happening around it uh, you are um, uh, how do you say you are really drowned into papers is what I see for many of you uh, you are doing certain things which are very very important administrative stuff uh, is seen in the second week and also I would highly recommend you to please I'm not recommend but suggest you dear Virgo that you please take all your papers while you travel like when you if you are traveling just make sure you have all the papers because that can get you into a mess because there is a element of losing certain papers that is seen or not having certain papers when they are required so my dear Virgo I would almost tell you is that uh, please take care of all your papers okay even while driving please carry all your papers so that um, you are not getting that fine from that cop who was just waiting around that roundabout there okay my dear Virgo and also I see that there is some kind of conflicting energy also in the second week in the sense uh, some people are trying to make you angry by provoking you so you need to take care with these kind of energies also don't pay heed uh, to what is useless okay just take what is good or what needs to be dealt with but uh, don't otherwise uh, you know just let it go yeah just ignore ignore ignorance is bliss at times and uh, you should do it in the second week not with your papers but but with people who are uh, provoking you just in order to have fun at your expense that you get you react and they are happy about it there are some people like that so you don't need to you know feed them uh, with your anger okay let them feed themselves with uh, their negative vibes and you need to go on your path my dear Virgo because now you're entering to, into the third week and the third week you are entering into a cycle of uh, luck you are entering into a very beneficial positive uh, week wherein once again your money is getting multiplied yes so once again whatever the problems botherations you had regarding money are disappearing in the third week of October money is coming in once again most probably some of you might be getting a job a new job is on the horizon which is very well paid a new contract comes in or a new client or you are selling your product for a very good price and uh, there are and number of buyers for it so all in all I see the third week is wonderful as far as money opportunities are, are concerned and I also see in the third week my dear uh, Virgo is that um, this luck period is beginning for you that means what is that you need to multiply don't let this phase just rest um, rather be just uh, you know stuck for a week you know like that okay it was for one week and now it's gone no 
try to you know uh, push your luck i would say <laughs> push your luck you know <laughs> in a very literal way you know like okay from this week i'm going to take you to the next week also and the weeks after also okay so if luck is your guest um i would say be very hospitable with your guest and uh, uh, so that uh, your guest would like to stay with you for long enough okay so luck is knocking at your door in the third week are you ready to open the doors my dear virgo and money is coming in and opportunities are coming in so you need to take good care of your luck your lovely guest who is going to be nicely lovingly staying with you for the third week and try to make the most of it okay sometimes you don't know how the luck disguises and comes and you, then you feel oh but it was a problem but I, in fact it was a blessing that had come and you didn't realize it it was disguised so much and you let it go and then you say ah oh, hard luck bad luck that's nothing like hard or bad luck it is just that you didn't recognize the opportunity so please keep your eyes open in the third week there are opportunities that are coming in so that your financial status your financial well-being is getting much and much better yes my dear Virgo and with this energy we are going to the fourth week now the fourth week is again about material gains this is what i said this whole week is all about material gains for you uh, dear virgo and uh, the fourth week i'm seeing also a masculine energy it can be a very protective energy as we had seen at the beginning that was a feminine energy in the theme but in the fourth week this is the uh, masculine energy dear virgo and this uh, this particular masculine energy can be a friend it can be your brother a young person i see more of a young and a dynamic person who is coming and um, providing you with certain very useful and precious inputs that are very much required for your progress now this progress can be personal or physical like um, you know for your health purpose it can be a professional one it can be a spiritual one related to the soul so this young and dynamic person is coming galloping your way my dear Virgo in the fourth week you are meeting someone most probably it can be also your brother uh, whom you have not met for long or a friend from abroad because this person is um, someone who is coming to you because he's seen coming so it shows that this person is somewhere not really immediately in your house something like that it's coming from outside okay it's coming from outside so from a distance we can say it. it can also be your colleague who is coming to your help for something right maybe he's in another department so he comes to you and he's trying to sort things out for you so the fourth week is a very supportive and protective week it is also for the lady virgos it also means a potential meeting with a very nice protective guy who's extremely intelligent he's a very well-to-do person in fact and um, can be a potential partner bringing stability into your life so don't shut him off <laughs> okay all right it depends upon you if you like him or not yes so it shows a potential meeting however uh, my dear virgo and otherwise it is seen that um, there is a wonderful and a neat improvement in your finances once again because uh, a person as i said this masculine energy is providing you with some kind of financial opportunities some kind of financial blessings are coming your way so all in all it seems to be money 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 and um, protection and keys there you have the destiny's key now what do you want to do the doors are in front of you you need to go and try the door which the key was for okay so take this key and open those locked doors and the world of opportunities lies in front of you my dear virgo for this month of october so thank you very much for staying and listening and please do like share and comment and do stay tuned in for the message of the universe which will be uploaded shortly to help us to see how to deal with the energies of this month of October. Autumn is here. <laughs> okay, my dear Virgo. So all in all, wonderful, wonderful month. But you have the keys and you know, 
if you don't use the key there's no point in having the key yes so use it please so key key <laughs> okay <laughs> all right god bless and take uh, good care of yourself your health eat well stay healthy balanced and abundant okay so god bless you all and see you next time bye bye take care bye